Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 99 Gaming. This is The Walking Dead Road to Survival Epic 5 Star Army update June the 18th, 2016. So before we get started, several shout outs and then a special shout out from me to a lot of different people. So Josh Lee, what's up? Lexi K, Emo Alex 18, and Jay Riz. Special shout out to you from Spencer Yoke, one of your uh, faction mates. So before we get into this video and look at some of the different characters, I want to say thank you once again for the last couple live streams. A lot of interaction. Those have been a lot of fun. We're going to do another one tomorrow morning on Father's Day at 10 a.m. Hopefully we can get a few more of you guys involved in it. So just want to go out and show my appreciation. And also, I may set up like a monthly giveaway like we did for the last one with some different trivia and some gifts, some prizes, all of those things. So leave that in the comments below in this video if you would like to see that as well. If you'd like to see like a monthly giveaway so we can get two, three, four, five hundred 500 people together, give away some prizes just to show my continued appreciation. I know that was on the 30,000 uh, uh, sub shout congratulation video, but I'd like to do that a little bit more regularly as well. So let's talk a little bit about my five star army. It's a little bit different than the last time you guys have seen it, and I get a lot of requests for these to show the characters. But the level up tournament really helped me out with a few of those. And you can see right there in the number two spot is Mirabelle. So uh, she's getting a little bit more powerful. But you guys can take a look at Rick. I have not done a whole lot with Rick. Um, pretty much the same as we did last time. And actually, he's off my team. He's been a staple for a long time, but he's been replaced with the Wanderer. So what I'd like for you guys to also do, leave in the comments below. You'll see my entire team. Let me know which direction you guys would like to see me level up. I've been leveling you know, pretty heavy the last week or so with Mirabelle and also the Wanderer. But since I do videos for you guys mostly, if there's something specifically you'd like to see or a team comp, then I want to make it happen. I'm also going to spend some time working on some weapons. So let's take a look at Mirabelle. If you missed the Mirabelle level up video, you can see there she is, fully maxed AR. Uh, look at those stats, uh, 666 attack power. Uh, she's pretty good defense and also uh, nice health as well too. Let's move forward and take a look at somebody else. Uh, Alicia, I think Alicia's pretty much been at that level. Uh, I do want to take her and max her out, so I'm going to spend a little bit more time. It's getting harder and harder to level these up. Caroline has been around for a long time. I don't really use Caroline anymore. Uh, she was huge into getting me up to a certain level, but she's been replaced with a little bit more firepower. I'm thinking of pushing Lee up to Tier 4 next, so leave in the comments if Lee is somebody you guys would like to see. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of votes for Andrew as well, too. And, and as you guys saw in that last war stream, I do need to diversify my team. I did not have a whole lot of good yellow uh, when I needed it. Uh, for some, some of those blue teams just rocked me. I think I lost two or three battles with those blue. I can't beat everybody with red, although I can try. But uh, Lee is somebody I definitely, because I have so much invested in this red team, I would like to take Lee up to level 4. You can see what it's going to take in order to upgrade him. I've got all the mats, so i got the school bag, i got the army talkie, I've got the belt with holster, so we're pretty good to go with Lee if we decide he's the next person. So Clementine, what do you guys think? Should Clementine be somebody that we push up and take to tier 4, upgrade her? Plenty of items as well too, so I could take both uh, Clementine and Lee up. Uh, they're pretty much part of my main team. The thing with Clementine is I really like that character, but she's very situational, and you guys have seen that when I don't have five people up or I, I've got... If I take out the leader in the middle and I've got two split levels, the top and the bottom, Clementine is definitely uh, not as effective. So here's somebody I've been working on quite a bit. You can see level 13, tier 3. This is the Wonder, awesome attack. And uh, that ranged, all ranged teammates get that plus 30 attack and 30 defense. He's such a better leader, in my opinion, than Rick. There's Rick. It's got to be alert, and, and there's the 30%. I'd rather have the defense than, than the uh, crit that Rick gives. But in order to take the Wonder up to tier 4, I got no night vision goggles because it was Mirabelle or it was the Wonder. So I had to use all six of my night vision goggles in order to take the Wonder. So I can level him off, but it's going to be a little while until I accumulate six. And when the next really big event comes, you know, I'm going to be farming that. So Glenn, I think Glenn uh, made it up a couple levels just for the level up tournament. Uh, I think he's a good character, but as I said mil millions of times, I got no other green characters. I cannot, I've tried. I tried the, the stupid box pack opening. I've tried the Michonne pack opening. I've tried Negan. I've tried everything, and I cannot get another green character. So um, really not a whole lot of purpose for me to level uh, Glenn unless I got somebody that he can go to war with. Andrea, you can see I've worked on several of the Andreas. So as I said before in the comments, I can upgrade some of the Andreas, but I only have four Alpenstocks left. So I'll take one of them up, but then the other three are just going to have to kind of sit in holding. But uh, you can see pretty solid there as well too. I do like... Andrea. Uh, there's the second Caroline. Ironically, you know, I get two Carolines. Why couldn't I have gotten two Lees? It's, uh, you know, same odds, but I still need that human shield. So, you know, that's probably what I'm going to be spending big on. If it's some off the wall character that I don't need or, you know, some other red that won't make it on my core five, 
I don't know that I'm going to keep doing them, but if, if it's a human shield and I can uh, I can incorporate that, I definitely will do it. Mark, I think Mark is very solid. Uh, I can build some teams around Mark and also Kenny. I've not done a whole lot with him. He is level 38, but uh, I could take Mark up. I mean, I got a lot of these items. You can see, look at the compass, the weather journal, plenty of oil beanies. So I really need to focus on getting all of these tier twos up to level up to tier three, and then uh, you know I'll take your advice on what we should take a little bit higher. Kenny as well too. Uh, plenty of gear to upgrade Kenny. No issues with that. And that's probably where I'm the most behind just on some of these tier twos. There's an Andrea as well too. Um, so we said before, there's Alpen stocks. I need to uh, stock up on the Alpen stocks. Tyrese. Um, this was a wake-up call for me as well too. I think I'm going to uh, work on some yellow as well before the next faction war. So I got Tyrese. Also got me some Oberson. I think Oberson's legit. You can see... Uh, I do need to work on his adrenaline rush, so let me uh, make a note of that. I'm going to make some new uh, leader, so I can get his adrenaline rush tapped off, uh, topped off there. Were all the other ones? I think all the other adrenaline rush were topped off, weren't they? How about Mark? Was Mark topped off? And Caroline's even. I don't. I don't have to worry about topping hers off. Even Glenn. So yeah, my adrenaline rushes are looking pretty good until we get down to Oberson. So all the Andreas are fully capped as far as Adrenaline Rush as well, too. So that's one thing I was able to do for the Level Up Tournament, so a nice update. Morgan has been capped off for a long time. I could take Morgan up. Um, camp Stoves, a few other items. And how about Ears? Ears is 7 out of 10, so that was a nice upgrade for me as well, too. You can see all teammates. That's the one nice thing about him. Uh, plus 30% against ranged uh, characters, so makes him super, super strong against those blue teams for sure. Mass attack, pretty solid as well, too. So, yeah, I think I will work on ears a little bit. That's uh, one. Gator. I know you guys want me to level up Gator, right? Yeah, worthless. i got to find a way. They need to do something with him. It's uh, He's definitely a hunter, for sure. And, yeah, he's a rebel, but I mean a hunter. Like, he's out hunting walkers, and he looks like a, uh, a hillbilly. And who else we got? And that is it. Unless I have somebody that's not on the team. Let me make sure. Did we go through all the epic five stars that we got? Yep. So that's the complete cycle. There's also some other four stars. Let me scroll through this because usually I just do the epic five star army. But I will show you some of the other ones that uh, I've worked on. And a lot of them were in the level up tournament as well too. So where do we start with the four stars? With Rosita. So Rosita's in pretty good shape. Got a Shane tier three. I could, uh, and that's already, all I got to do is upgrade that. It's a lot of food, though, and I'm not going to waste my Alpen stocks on Shane when I can use my Alpen stocks on Andrea. Molly as well, too. So, yeah, I'm still a little bit weak, I think, um, with the green. But as far as yellow, you know, we could do something with Tyrese, Oberson, Morgan, Ben. So pretty pretty uh, solid yellow. Still can't get that Jesus. I would have built teams around Jesus, but you guys have seen how many pack openings that I've uh, tried for that as well, too. So thanks, everyone, for watching and tuning in. Um, you know, I appreciate everything you guys do every single day. As I said before, I work on this Epic Army a little bit. Leave a lot of comments because I read through all of your comments, even if I don't answer each one of them personally. And also, tune in tomorrow if you haven't seen one of the live streams. It's very random. It's funny. Uh, sometimes I can't get the recorder to work. Who knows? All kind of crazy stuff. But uh, we will definitely have some fun with it. My name is Killshot. Give this video a thumbs up, and you guys have a super afternoon. Peace.